Now we shall learn the fundamentals of link queries. First of all, you would want to know why link queries. So why link? Uh, this is what I have to say, an experienced developer developer of MVC he begins to realize that link is something that has a very close relationship with MVC. It is as if MVC is a lot simplified if one has a knowledge of link. So it looks as if MVC is written keeping in mind the existence of link. So uh, you can do most of the things with ADO.NET with the traditional ADO.NET SQL data reader, data set no doubt they will be available to you but they involve a lot of junk code so if we can avoid that junk code and have an already available framework in link that can do queries for you in a more standard way, structured way then why not go for link It will simplify not only your combination to MVC, not only your communication with MVC, but also it will simplify the number of lines of code you write. And link is very readable. So it comes naturally to a C sharp developer. It is available in Visual Basic also, so that is not our objective in this training course. So let us now begin to uh, understand the fundamentals of link. We will start from the very very basics so that the concept clarity is there. And that over a period of time you are able to build upon that knowledge to do even more complicated things. Let us start. What can be done with link? One, you can do the equivalent of select query. Select a certain number of records matching a criterion or criteria. Number two, you can update delete and insert new records. This is also possible with link. And if the built-in link queries are not sufficient for something or you find them too complicated, then in certain cases you can cause a direct query to SQL also. Query in SQL. You can write your own direct query and execute it against database. Just like you would have done with traditional ADO.NET. We learn this, we learn this later. In the coming days we will begin to learn this so that through this we are able to uh, master the fundamentals of link. At no point in your understanding or working with link will you ever feel that something is not present here. Generally it does happen to us when we are learning a new technology and we all of a sudden look for something which existed in our previous technology and we look for equivalents in this. And many times it does happen that the new technology does not have